Hey there beautiful creatures, it's Kayla. Welcome back to my channel, or if you're new here, hi. I'm Kayla, I am medicated, caffeinated, and enlightened, and I'm the greatest freaking person ever, so you should subscribe, hit the notification bell, and be present for all of my shenanigans. <laughs> like today, um, I wanted to talk about some non-makeup or beauty related YouTube channels that I watch when I am not watching beauty content. I watched Angelica Nyquist and Nikki Raven do this. They did a collab, but I'm kind of doing it as a tag. So um, they each did 10, uh, kind of like a top 10, not really a top, but just a 10. And um, I have my little list here of 10 YouTubers. I don't have the fancy editing that they do because if we don't edit around here. <laughs> I'm trying to learn. I'm trying to learn. I'm, I'm trying. So get you some coffee. Uh, partake in the smokage if you do. Um, also, good morning. It's morning when I'm filming this. Whenever you're watching this, I hope you've had a wonderful, wonderful day. Okay, let's start off with, <laughs> since I just did the sip and ah, we can start off with Bunny, also known as Graveyard Girl. I love watching Graveyard Girl, but her second channel, Banana Peppers, I adore. She does like weird unboxings and like, I love watching um, her unbox, like, uh, blind boxes and stuff like that. I find it very relaxing. Do I buy that shit and unbox those things? No. Am I a six-year-old that needs Shopkins? No. But do I think it's adorable when she gets little tiny figurines that she's just going to keep in a box somewhere? Yes. Yes, I do. Uh, let's move on to... Uh, but I highly recommend her. All of these channels I, I watch and I enjoy and would recommend. And I will make sure they are all listed down below in the description. That part of the editing I will get done. I promise. I promise. Um, Katie Carson with Royalty Soaps. I love watching soap making videos. But her videos mostly just because she has some of the cutest stories. And she I relate to her because she lives in... A small town in Texas and I live in a small town in Oklahoma and it's 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 pretty pretty similar but soap making I find so satisfying and uh, just the way the way she does her soaps and her soap frosting is very very satisfying to watch um I really am into like sewing right now so I've been watching a lot. Um, her name is Rachel Mackey, Makey. I don't remember her last name, but I'll make sure she's listed down below. She does the cutest sewing projects out of thrifted stuff. And it's very cottage core, witchy recreations of stuff like that. She's just adorable. And her little dog's name is Frodo. And he's just, oh, she's so adorable and amazing to watch. I really like her. And she does, like, lifestyle uh, sewing, uh, role play, uh, cosplay, making things like that. Um, another person that does lifestyle stuff in that realm is Christine McDonald. She uh, is creepy and kooky and everything I love. She just recently bought a house in New York and she's been remodeling it and uploading about once a month. But I can't... Oh. I love when she uploads and I just savor every moment of those videos because she's so creative and so inspiring and I just, uh, I love it. I love it. Another inspiring thing is nails. I love to do my nails. I watch all kinds of nail videos, but my favorite one to watch is Christy Macon from um, the Neo Nails channel is where I found her or actually uh, my friend Cassidy recommended that I watch her and so now I'm subscribed to her actual channel, the um, Christy Macon, and she just does these beautiful nail creations, and I learn so much from her. She's an excellent teacher, and she's super funny, too. Um, let's see, what else do I have on here? Um, my Tarot, my Katie McLaughlin, my Pisces Club, my Pisces Gang. Oh, I love my tarot readings. I am a witch. I am pagan. If you did not know, hello, I'm Kayla. I am a witch, and, uh, her tarot readings, she does them every day, several times a day, and she's just so spot on, and I love the way she reads, and it's, um, it helps me to intuitively read when she reads, so it, it, I don't know, I just really enjoy her style of tarot and intuitiveness. Okay. Laura Lathe. 
she used to do beauty, but now she does mostly lifestyle stuff. She's Danish, I believe. She lives in the Netherlands, I believe. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong, but I'll link her down below and you can find out all about her. She's adorable. She owns her own lash company. And she uh, recently started an Etsy store for these like calendar pages and coloring pages. She's so creative and she has these two adorable cats that look exactly the same. And they're just troublemakers. And she's just so sweet and so genuine. And I love her style. It's nothing like mine, but I get so much inspiration from her too. Uh, okay, let's talk about my obsession with the paranormal. Speaking of being a witch, I love the supernatural. I love paranormal. I love watching haunted exploration videos of old abandoned buildings. It's just, I love to lay there at night. The, you have women who watch true crime at night to relax, and you have women who watch haunted exploration videos to relax. Hello, my name is Kayla, and I watch haunted exploration ex videos. <laughs> my two... Well, my haunted explorer favorite is Lomar Mendez. Oh, him and his girlfriend, Chelsea. They just, I don't know. There's something about them and the way he edits his videos are really, really well done. And I just enjoy watching his content. And another one that they don't really do haunted explorers. Um, they used to, but now they do mostly paranormal um, investigation stuff, helping out families and people in need is Twin Paranormal. Oh, those boys and uh, River Wyatt. Nick and Ryan, I believe is what their names are. There's four. The twins are River and Wyatt. And then you have the other two boys, Nick and Ryan, I believe, that are their best friends. And they go and they're just, they're younger. So I don't know. They have just this way about them, the way they interact with the, with the afterlife and the spirit world and all of this stuff is very true and very genuine. And it, it. I don't know, I really enjoy <laughs> watching them be scared men in the dark. My my sugar bear makes fun of me when I he asks me, what are you doing? I'm watching YouTube. What are you watching? Men being scared in the dark. <laughs> oh, and I think, oh, and another thing is Nuke's Top 5. That is just a fun thing for me to watch. It's like a Top 5 countdown weekly of just random videos on the internet of maybe paranormal, supernatural, pernatural, UFO alien videos. Are they, are they not? I, I like watching those types of things to see, to guess, is it, is it not? What could it actually be? The debunking part I actually enjoy. So yeah, I think that was everybody on my little list here. And this was actually a pretty short video for one of my videos. And I hope you check out all of the people I talked about down below. If any of them sounded interesting to you, they are, they are, they are good. From, in my humble opinion, they are, they are good. But, you know, my, my opinion is humble. All right, well, I guess I will leave it at that. Let me know some other non-beauty YouTubers that I need to go check out. Even if they're not in the wheelhouse of what I randomly watch. I will randomly watch just about anything, <laughs> as long as it's inspiring and uplifting and fun to watch. Or ASMR. ASMR, I listen to a lot of that to relax and go to sleep. I listen to a lot of crackling fire at night, <laughs> even though I do not have a fireplace. I mean, I won't get into that. Anyway, I'm going to let you go. I'm going to go finish this coffee and I'm going to go watch some scared men in the dark. <laughs> I'll see you in my next one. Bye.